Hey, it's Vlogity 1033. That's way too many vlogs if we're being honest. Or just being honest. Good morning. Today's gonna be a quick video, as you probably can tell from the timestamp. Gonna do a little bit of an opening here. Thanks to everybody who sent me stuff or brought stuff. A lot of people <laughs> brought stuff and left it at the Peloton. I appreciate it. And I figured I'd open these. Uh, these go back a couple weeks, I think, actually. I think I'd open these before I head to the States while telling you why I'll be heading to the States. <laughs> Thank you very much. Who's this from? Is this from my mom? No. Penny. Okay, here's the thing. Penny. Penny Storms. Thank you so much. I really appreciate this. This is really kind of you. And the reason I wondered that is because you have a very similar style of craftiness to my mom, who is why I'm going back to the States right now. Thank you very much. I'm gonna read, I'm gonna read into this a little bit more. And thank you for the gift as well. That's really kind of you. Now, here's the thing. I'm going back to the States uh, because family stuff is going on. Many of you know already that my mom has Parkinson's, which is a progressive, uh, if not degenerative disease. And it is one that has definitely is having its effect. Oh, hey, Dennis. Dr. Dennis, thank you very much. I appreciate it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna read through this whole thing here saying, I think, Dennis, I believe you're the one that sent me, you gave me the mug. This is a very Texan, a def Texan set. There is, I've already seen what's in here because everybody at the Peloton was too curious not to know. This is like a reusable mug. Ther this is great, a thermal mug. Very Texas branded, and whoa, look at that. He marked it with my Space Invader there. That's pretty amazing. Okay, thank you very much for this. And we had to wrap this because it actually burst in transit and so there was a little bit of hot sauce all over the place. Uh, there's some habanero hot sauce in here. So these were kind of already depackaged when I got them. The Habanero Taco Company, thank you very much. Thankfully the coffee mug is not as spicy as the sauce. I'm very much looking forward to trying that. So things have gotten kind of crazy back at home. Things are a little bit intense and I'm going back to spend some time with my family, uh, in particular to help my dad with some transitions that are going on and figure it out. So there, I wasn't planning on going back to the States. I'm gonna go to a wedding while I'm back too. I've been invited to three different weddings back in the Northwest this year and I'd said no to all of them because I kind of felt like it was a little bit too much and they're really spread out and I didn't know how to say yes or no to any of them. And I wanted to go to all of them, but also money was tight. You know how it goes. And then uh, things kind of started taking some weird turns back back in, in, in uh, Spokane with my parents and I was like, well, I, I wanna go back. I wanna be available and supportive. And especially for those of you that are familiar with diseases like this, my dad is kind of a caretaker in a lot of ways and, uh, and I wanna go support him directly as he supports my mom and spend some time with my mom as well. So I got a ticket for originally a pretty short period of time and then things just kind of, I don't know, have escalated. And, uh, and so I'm gonna stay a little bit longer than I was originally planning. This is a Pike's Place then and now. Mountains, coffee, and atmosphere. The three things that you love most about Seattle in order. Thank you very much. Who's this from? This isn't signed, uh, but thank you for the postcard. I appreciate it. It's kind of draining and it, I've been, I've already been kind of exhausted after the, the 2020 was genuinely physically and just kind of mentally exhausting. This whole situation has also been pretty tiring, which is fine. It's the way that it goes, um, but I'm definitely feeling a little bit of the crunch. Hey, thanks. Say hello to Gustav. I gave, I, said, I gave Gustav a belly rub today, so hopefully that's good for you. Carl, I appreciate it. Carl, thank you for being a patron. Hello to New York City, and uh, thanks for the card. I really appreciate it. It's very thoughtful of you. So that's kind of what's going on, and that's why I've already kind of preemptively said that I'm going to be, oh, this bag broke. That's where the, <laughs> that's where the whole, that's where this bag came out. This is a beer, but I didn't look at the beer yet. Bainbridge Brewing, Eagle Harbor IPA, wow. I'm gonna put this in the fridge right now. Whoa, everything's falling apart here. Oh, nice, and a Bainbridge Brewing Company shirt. Excellent, ooh, this is really soft, this is nice. Here's the thing, if you want me to ever wear a shirt, just make sure that it's pretty simple and pretty soft, and there's a good chance it's gonna happen because this is just like snuggle soft. Whew, thank you very much. Well, who's this from, hold on, is there, a sign? is there a, is there a note? Is there no note, or is it somebody else that I already opened stuff from? Who, take, Take credit in the comments, whoever you are from Bainbridge Brewing Company, Bain, Br Bain, Bain, Bainbridge Brewing Company, appreciate it. So all these things, oh, here we go. Julie, oh, I think this is from Julie. Thank you, Julie. If it's not, let me know. Uh, the notes got a little bit mixed up, but I really appreciate it. So for those of you wondering why I'm going back to the States, that's why it's for family stuff. I'm going to simplify my vlog kind of like today, um, but we'll see how it goes. I'm really gonna be spending time with family, trying to support them 
I don't really know what all is going to be happening when I hit the ground. I'm not exactly sure what the situation is going to look like, and I'm not sure how much energy or time I'm going to have. I'm not going to stop vlogging because I really love doing it. I think it's really important, and I'm going to try to share what I can as I go because I also think that that's important. But my family is going to be my priority over the next, you know, couple of weeks. And so I really appreciate the support and the kind words. Uh, if you are not into Spokane content, uh, then definitely go back and watch all the Parisian content that I've already made. French Fridays, the 20 and 20. There's all kinds of good stuff that you can watch and just there's a thousand vlogs behind us that you can check in on and you can go back and binge from the beginning and see how I got here and how I managed to survive the madness that has been my life for so long. But in the meantime, I got a pack, I got it ready. I was trying to relax a little bit today uh, and I'm gonna try and, uh, and rest, well, pff, the rest of the evening. I mean, I'm, I'm catching a flight tomorrow, so we'll see how it goes. But I just wanted you to know why it is that I'm heading home, why it is that I'm probably gonna be extra exhausted for a while. I've already been a little bit wiped. And uh, and that things are okay though at the same time. I think everything's gonna be all right. Uh, it's just, it is a little bit extra intense right now. It's a little bit extra dramatic, but we've got a handle on it, I think. So I'll let you know as we go. Thanks to everybody who sent me some swag here. Thank you to all of you who are watching every day. Thank you to my patrons who make all of this possible in a way that's never been possible before. And I just hope that you all have a wonderful day wherever it is you are, that you're happy, healthy, and with people that you love. And I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning for a travel day, which will probably be a longer vlog just because I'll be traveling. But then of course, we'll just see what happens when we hit the ground uh, running in Spokanistan and uh, never know what's gonna happen when we get there. Hopefully Pizza Pipeline at the very least, hopefully Pizza Pipeline. I'll see you tomorrow.